I never went to see the Black Panther, and I will never see the Black Panther, even if it's offered in my living room for free, because it's based on fiction. I don't do fiction. My people's history has been rubbished and erased and lied about so much. I don't have time to feed historical fiction in my life because the Black Panther is a real story that has to be told. Again, a matriarchy, a saronia. That was the title, like you have the Kendake Queens. All these people are in my book, by the way. So she fought a bitter war, and I say she, even if different saronias were coming on, because Arabs came in 476, the white people were 1400 onwards. But they could not Islamize them. So they say, the, the Arabs tell them, oh no, you will take Niger, but those villages, those villages ruled by Saroni, you will not take them. The French say, oh, this is our born. We will see. I like what they say. We will see between their God and our God who is powerful. Today we say it's the same God because we are confused, because we hold on so much to Christianity, we don't want to let go. It's painful to realize the false doctrine. That's what the French say. They are mass reinforce, they go to war. Cut a long story short, they defeat uh, Avantubaka Saroni. I don't know why it's running away from me what they were called right now. I'm forgetting it. They defeat them. They're going to behead her. So they strip her naked. That's what they all did with her people. It's the same thing they did to Sarah Bartman because it's first point of humiliation. They strip her naked. They chain her. They call all her people to a square because that's how we built pre-colonially. Things basically are a band. And it's that's why I'm as Latin job to Nelwe Banja. That's how you resolve problems. So they call them to the village square. They are going to show them that Jango Banja Ninga Funi Ugu converted to Christianity Ninga Funu colonizer. Lendwe Ni Bambile, African spirituality is a boy compared to Jesus. So we are going to behead your king, in, your queen in front of you. So by am let her get naked. The people can't look but Jango pants. That's their queen. Who naked in chains. Village Square. She says to them, if you claim you are as civilized as you claim than us, and you are going to behead me, and it is your law. It is in our law before she sends to to ask them, what is there anything you want to say? Are you going to ask me? But what do you want to say? Ati, allow me just one grace. Divumeleni ndie pa endumbe where I speak with my ancestors for the last time, they allow her. She goes in there. Time passes. It's leading up to an hour. Everyone is like they are seized onto the square. They can't move, but they're restless, especially the French, because they want to get it over with. Before the hour passed, those doors flung open. What came out was a black panther. Christianity tells you today that shape-shifting is evil. I want to shape-shift. Because if I can shape-shift, I will liberate a lot of my people. She shape-shifted into a panther. The bottom line is they couldn't kill her, they couldn't behead her, and she left an even greater testimony to her people that it is not true that African spirituality is subjected or smaller than Christianity. And they had to give her a card of honor as that panthers merrily rode through the crowds and disappeared into the forest.